guys, this is Donna. So if you're seeing this today, that means that my swap partner has gotten this. So um, I did a swap with um, Scrapbooking With Me Boutique um, that is owned by Edith Ray. And we had a little swap, and it was supposed to be for a romance pocket letter. And so this is my pocket letter, and my um, swap partner was uh, Linda. And so, um, I just used what I had in my stash and, you know, kind of going back to the old ways of creating pocket letters, not putting so much on the outside plastic, but actually creating each little card. And so what I did was, um, I used the paper called, uh, let me get the scraps out of the way. I try to keep everything together for my scraps and the paper. Then I use this called Floral Muse, and I got this from Scrapbooking with Me uh, Boutique. It is, um, I think I got it from there. It's Dovecraft, um, but it's beautiful paper line, and um, it's very. It has a very romantic feel to it, so that's why I used it. So on this card, it was just like a little butterfly. And I put some wild orchid craft roses there on the paper. And just a little flat back that I got from Shabby Chic Boutique. And then on this one, um, I have these little tiny hearts. And these came from Natasha Scrapped the Corner. And then um, I like the little paper square. It's got like little letters written on it. So that's why I wrote notes. So on the back side is my note. And then I have these two tiny little flowers that came from Prima. And then on this one, it says, Life is Beautiful. And I have a die-cut word that says love there. And then I just have this little page flag. Uh, it's in the same color because the back pocket wanted to pop open. And I wanted to make sure that whatever was in there stayed in there. And so on this pocket, I just have the floral paper. I have a little... Um, layered flower it was punched out of paper and then some white and then a little tiny pink with a flat back on top and then i just took a piece of the scrap paper from this paper and i made a little page flag here and then this is the life is beautiful paper again and i took a strip um of this paper here and um i just layered it down there and then i fussy cut one of the little butterflies out from the scraps stickled it and put it on there and then I love this paper right here. This is actually a uh, Brad from a Prima collection that I had. And it just went so well with the flowers on there. And then here I used some more of the little flat backs and one of the little flowers. And then this is some trim I got here from Shabby Chic Boutique as well. And then um, another, this is another little flower that I had. Um, and then I took a piece of the scrap of the paper and I made a little envelope and stuck a little flat back to close it down. Now there's nothing in it and it's just for decorations, basically. And then I have this little heart with a fringe on it that says love. And then a little pink wild orchid craft flowers. Now I'm just going to show the back really quick because I don't want, just in case, but I'm sure she has it. But this is the back right here and I did double sided back. And then instead of running washi tape down it, since it's sort of romance, and I didn't want to ruin the look of it with washi tape, so I just tied some ribbon on the top and the bottom, and then I used a little brad to attach a little paper tassel um, on the side to hang down. So that is my pocket letter. And um, so I hope you like it. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. So thank you all so much, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.